Hey, hey viewers, my name's Cookie Labap and so is the show. The main category of this show is sensational reviews, where we review anything that excites the senses, whether sight, sound, smell, taste, or touch. Today, we're going to be reviewing a treat near to my heart, apple pie. Originated in England and can be accompanied with ice cream, whipped cream, and oddly in my opinion, cheddar cheese. Ugh. So stay viewing to keep updated on this delicious, spoiler alert, pie and how it went. Here we are. And here is the delicious apple pie. I baked it in my kitchen myself and added a crumbled topping. You can also add a lettuce with your leftover pastry or no topping at all. My variation, I would say, would be considered the Dutch apple pie. And I've also decided to add two scoops of vanilla ice cream, as you see right here, because without the ice cream, you wouldn't have the original combination sensational experience. <laughs> say that three times. The original combination sensational experience. So let's go for it. As you can see, I put a lot of ice cream in here. I love ice cream, but I also love apple pie too, so. Mm. It was a big first bite. Mm. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I did really good. Not trying to boost myself, but, but to be honest, I did really good at making this pie. But the thing is, with the main ingredients being flour, butter, apple, sugar, salt, what did you really mess up? I love that I also added the crumble. The crumble is basically flour, cinnamon, sugar, mixed together and then you add melted butter with it as well let that cool down and once it dries up it becomes more of a crumbled texture for you to sprinkle on top right before you put it into the bake it really gives a good crunch too at the top Another thing that I like to bake that's similar to this is more of like the French tap, French style apple pie. It's the tartare tan. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. I'm pretty sure somebody's going to say I haven't, but the tartare tan is really, really delicious. Caramelized, caramelized apple. Sorry, I kind of walked away there. Had a roommate that woke up, so I just wanted to make sure I didn't disturb him. But caramelized apple with sugar and butter and a, I use a cast iron skillet because it's really good for me. I love a cast iron skillet. When you season it well, it can work with anything. So use a cast iron skillet to caramelize the sugar and then I go ahead and put the butter and extra seasoning. Sometimes I like to put a star anise if I have any. And um, then I just put a pastry on top. It's actually a little bit more easier than just making an apple pie itself. So I recommend trying it. Or maybe I could just try it here myself for you guys just to enjoy. Mm. Another thing I think you should try if you do this is pecans. Roast them. No, saute them with butter and salt. And then roast them maybe in a toaster. If you don't have, maybe if you still have the oven on after baking the pie, roast them in the oven or maybe in a toaster just for a bit and add them with the ice cream. Butter, salted pecans with the vanilla ice cream in addition with the pie. 
I just can't think of a better combination. You could put caramel too, but you've caramelized the apples enough to where you already have kind of a caramel. <laughs> the apples cook through so well. Look at that apple. You see how it's like really, really jiggly. <laughs> Delicious. Wow. The crust is so buttery and flaky. For the crust, I use more of like an all butter crust. So it's just butter, two cups, no, one cup of butter, two cups of flour, two and a half, some salt and basically a little bit of cold water. Mix that all together and... Mm. Don't forget to add sugar. Yeah. Mm. recommend even if you don't want to just bake it yourself just to buy you a really decent apple pie from any local bakery it's definitely going to bring joy I love baked fruit not that many people I know don't but I do know who do so I mean if not if it's not your thing it's fine but me Pies and tarts, top tier. Hands down. <laughs> Hands down. One of the best bakes I've done. The crust came out right. The crumble came out right. The pie filling came out right. Also, just to add, I separated the pie filling after cooking it from the juices and re caramelized the juices on itself, then added it back, giving it an extra caramel flavor that added well with the ice cream you don't really need any caramel sauce or any other toppings with it other than the pecans like I said in early in the video other than that I definitely approve of apple pie in general this is basically a general review I would say go ahead and do any type of variation or style that you like there are many French Dutch American Swiss I think Swiss I think I'm pretty sure I saw Swiss when I researched it a bit. Well, that's all for now. I'll see you soon. See you soon. There you have it. Apple pie. They come in different styles and variations, but all are sensational experiences if cooked with care. That's all for now. Keep updated on the latest sensation review and don't be hesitant to send or suggest anything interesting in the comment section below. See ya. See ya.